Good afternoon, everyone. I am here in my kitchen. I'm sitting on my uh, like outdoor folding chair, whatever you call it, a patio outdoor chair, little folding chair or camping chair. And I'm here in my kitchen and I am drinking from, I've got this uh, elephant mug here. <laughs> I bought this at the family dollar today for only two bucks. I'm a big fan of coffee mugs, and uh, here it is. So let's do a live stream. Let's do a live stream. Let's just talk about whatever. Mm. It's an elephant mug. Hey, Will Shoot. Hey, buddy. What do you think about my new mug? It's kind of an interesting mug. First of all, it was only $2, so that's a great price. But like, if you like, look at the... The hole is actually kind of small, and then it, it gets big, and then it, it goes in, and then it goes out again. So the hole is kind of small. When you sip, your nose hits the, the lid. Oh, it's kind of an interesting mug, but it's an elephant mug. <laughs> All right? <laughs> and I'm sitting here. I'm in my camping chair, and I'm trying to get, like, I'm too far away from the screen, but anyway. Yeah, hey, Will, maybe I'll do a not too shabby. I'll do a not too shabby of my elephant uh, mug a little later on, you know? So it's live in Colorado, Westcliff, Colorado. Beautiful Southern Colorado in the heart of the Wet Mountain Valley. I could promote, promote my town of Westcliff. Nice little town. If you're in Pueblo, go west. Hit Take a State Highway 96 west from Pueblo. Take that about an hour, and it's mostly west, a little bit south, and you'll be in Westcliff. Beautiful Westcliff. So, Will Shoot, how are you, man? Hey, sucker. Hey, buddy. You're in Indianapolis, Indiana? That's cool. How'd you find me, soccer? How did you find me? Will, where are you located? Uh, I got my phone here. I want to show you a picture of, uh, let's see. I think I got a good picture. A couple of days ago, I was on, we have this little park to park trail. It's just a little dirt trail. But here, I'll show you. There's the trail and there are the mountains. That's the Sangre de Cristo Mountains right there. Westcliff, Colorado. That's actually in Silvercliff. I was standing in Silvercliff. There's two little towns called Westcliff and Silvercliff, and they're mushed together. But anyway, we're essentially one town. And look at that beautiful mountain range. Isn't that neat? Pretty neat. Will shoot, you're in Austin, Texas. That's cool. Hey, soccer. You've seen my videos. Uh, in Southern Arizona, right? And elsewhere. But yeah, I, I make videos of the border or whatever is there, the fencing or, you know, whatever is. So, and they get watched a lot because people are curious about the border and, you know, the controversy and all that. But I just love the scenery. Yeah, man, that's cool, soccer. Soccer, I live in Westcliff, Colorado. Here, look up my town. I already just showed you a picture of it, but Westcliff. Colorado. All right. I just put in the, in the chat section, do a Google, do an image search of that on Google and you'll see most of the photos, most of the photos that'll probably pop up are like big, beautiful. Like here's a, here's a, here's just a common shot when you're in town. That's the Westcliff Inn. It's a motel. And uh, there's just big, massive mountains. So, hey, soccer. Oh, wait, which El Paso video? The one, the UTEP hill? I hiked up this little hill on the campus of the University of Texas El Paso. So, Will Shoot, take care of yourself, buddy. Will Shoot, thanks for coming by. It's coffee time. Coffee time in my elephant mug. Look at that. Look at this elephant mug. 
Isn't this amazing? And there, there is coffee in there. <laughs> this mug only costs two dollars. It only costs two dollars at the uh, at the Family Dollar. So how about that? Isn't that amazing? Sam the King, how are you, buddy? Everyone, Sam the King, I made a video with Dwight. I got a video with Dwight. He was uh uh he was chopping wood. <laughs> Here's the video of Dwight. <laughs> it's not the most it's not the most exciting video. Wait, I keep pushing the wrong buttons here. Here's Dwight. Dwight is chopping wood again. Winter pastime. He's he's a great guy. He's a really great guy. Very nice. Look at all the wood Dwight has. <laughs> oh god, wood. That's a lot of wood. Will you chop a big block of wood again? Will I? <laughs> what? Today or right now? Or right what? now. Chop one of the chop that big block right there. Oh yeah, here we go. All right, that's one. That's two. One more time. That's three. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I think it took him nine times. That's a, that's a tough block of wood right there. Four. This. <laughs> Five. Six. <laughs> what, what's with that piece of wood? Matt's running all through it, all different directions. At this point, I was starting to feel bad because he was getting a workout. He turned it over. He's going to get it now. Seven. Eight. Eight. Like, where'd you get that axe, by the way? Where did I get it? Yeah. Axe store. I think that's nine. <laughs> Great job. All right, he, it took. I think it. I think that was ten. If I counted correctly, I think it took him ten times. So, do I know Indianapolis, Indiana? Yes, I have soccer. I've been to. I've driven through Indianapolis. I think one time in my life. I was only driving through, but that's it. So, you know what they say about Indiana? That it usually like. Indiana is a great state to drive through on your way to somewhere, you know, better. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Jennifer, Dwight is in really good shape. It, yeah. So, and then the Axe Store. I like that too. That was pretty funny too. Soccer, it's beautiful. It's beautiful in Indianapolis. I don't know, man. Like, what kind of mountains do you have? Do you get? Do you have mountains in Indiana? I'm a, I'm a mountain guy. I'm a Coloradan. I'm a Coloradan, and then in the winter I'm an Arizonan. All right, mountains and desert. So, Dwight's a great guy. Seriously, Dwight. Dwight's a great guy. Uh, and also, let me say something. <laughs> People were like, he he doesn't. Uh, Dwight didn't like the color of my car, but it was all right. I actually, a lot of people don't like the color of my car, but I, I didn't, there was like one comment where somebody was kind of negative and I, I deleted it, but I egged on Dwight. I said, come on, Dwight, if you don't like the, my car color, we need to make video. And then I, you know, <laughs> so then he said, I don't like it. <laughs> it looks like someone ate a lima bean and got sick and vomited it. So, anyway, soccer, have you ever been to Colorado? Soccer, you need to visit Colorado. Seriously, come visit Come visit Colorado. We've got beautiful, big, beautiful mountains. So, let me just show you a few pictures. Just around town. Here was the sunset. So, we've got a huge range of mountains to the west of Westcliff. And this was a sunset about a month ago. Really pretty sunset right there. All right. 
I'm promoting my town now. I'm just into Westcliff. Here, here's all right. I was at the garbage dump. This is the landfill in Custer County, Colorado. That's the landfill. That's some dumpster right there. See the dumpster? You can kind of see like in the middle right there. There's some kind of like, you know, that's where they're throwing trash or whatever. You got huge mountains. So huge mountains. It's not too shabby. So 70 Freeway East. You visited uh, Colorado last year? Ha <laughs> ha! Jennifer, how are you doing? Are you working? Are you working? Here's a great shot. Main Street in Westcliff. Main Street in Westcliff. This was like four weeks ago. This is this is the day my car was officially dead. And I was walking home. And I left it at that gas station on the left. And they were really nice. And they just said, yeah, your car, it's done. So anyway, I was walking back. And I was like, wow, look at those mountains. Big, beautiful mountains. That was only a few weeks ago. So, yeah, it is really beautiful soccer. Yeah, Colorado, Colorado, and then New Mexico and Arizona are my three favorite states. For a little longer, yes, you're not dialing anyone this late, though. Jennifer, what do you think about my, uh, my elephant mug? I got this at the Family Dollar for only two bucks. Two dollars. And on the bottom, it, see the bottom? It says not microwavable or dishwater safe. Hand wash only. Made in China. It's a little elephant mug. It's kind of cute. Isn't it cute? It's not very, it's more of a, it's not like, it doesn't, it's hard to hold it and the hole here is kind of small and you're, it's just a little, it's a little odd. It's a novelty mug, but it is very cute. Yeah. Soccer just passing through Denver. All right. Now when you're in Denver, now this is for anyone who doesn't know Colorado well. If you're in Denver, get on I-70 and just go west. Pretty much, you'll see, I-70 goes west-east across Colorado. I-25 goes north-south, uh, you know, up and down through Colorado. Just stay west of I-25 and go into the mountains. Just go west of I-25, wherever you're at, you know. That's where all the mountains are. So just go west. So I-70 or any of the other highways. If you're in Pueblo, go west and visit West Cliff or go to Canyon City and then into Salida. So, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Anyway, maybe this is boring, but I'm just promoting Colorado. I used to work. I had uh this was uh 4 years ago. This was 4 years ago. Early 2017, December 2016. I worked at the Colorado Welcome Center in Trinidad, Colorado. And um, I, you know, all you do is you just sit there and you greet everyone who walks in and you pretty much say, hey, the bathroom's over there. Most people are looking for the bathroom. They might pick up literature. There's just tons of brochures. You try to answer questions and you be friendly. Even if you don't know like answers, it's okay to just say, I don't know. But you know what I mean? So you're just trying to encourage people, welcome them to to uh to Colorado. In fact, I did uh a not too shabby of the Colorado Welcome Center where I used to uh work. Here it is. Let's see. Here it is. Colorado Welcome Center, Trinidad, Colorado. It's the Colorado Welcome Center. Not too shabby. Ha 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 ha. Yeah, yeah. Oh, actually, hey, here's a Colorado welcome mat. Colorado welcome doormat right here. It's my Colorado doormat. 
Not too shabby. Oh, yeah. So I got that. So, and if you're here at my house, I'd loan you my Colorado Road Atlas. It's a Colorado Road Atlas. Not too shabby. <laughs> that was a weird delivery, wasn't it? Let's play that one one more time. It's a Colorado Road Atlas. Not too shabby. <laughs> anyway, I've got other Colorado E. While I'm on the Colorado kick, oh, at the Welcome Center, the Colorado Welcome Center, there's a wall map of Colorado. Here it is. It's a large wall map of Colorado. Not too shabby. <laughs> <laughs> so many Colorado y things. How about a Colorado jigsaw puzzle? You want Colorado? I'll it's give it to a you. Colorado jigsaw puzzle. Not too shabby. Colorado jigsaw puzzle. Look at all these Colorado things I got. So many Colorado things. Colorado flag? I don't remember this one. It's a Colorado flag. Not too shabby. <laughs> oh, one more. Wetmore. This is just a little town called Wetmore, Colorado. And here's here it is. It's Wetmore, Colorado. Not too shabby. <laughs> Hey, Z. Hey, Z. All right, so there you go. Those are some of my Colorado not-too-shabbies. So, yes, yes, soccer, I like tacos. I like tacos a lot. And I also like burgers. See the burgers? <laughs> but we'll keep it on the tacos right here. Yeah. The Wetmore one, the Wetmore one is not too shabby. I want to play that. At, I want to play that at like twenty five percent. I just want to see. Wait, where's the? I want to play that in slow motion. Okay, where is it here? Playback speed. All right, here we go. It's going to be much slower now. Here we go. <laughs> oh, you guys. Yeah, I love tacos. Absolutely love tacos. Jennifer, yes. I got the free Wi-Fi going on up there as well. The free Wi-Fi. I got to get more display signs. I need to get like 10 or 15 more display signs just flashing all over my house. You know what I mean? That would be amazing. I might have to go shopping. I, I found it in this store in El Paso, Texas, these display ads. I don't even know where else you can get them. You know, but maybe somewhere in Colorado, they have them. So, <laughs> Z, how are you doing? I got my elephant mug. That's the theme of today's live stream is Colorado. I think I called it Colorado Live. Coffee in an elephant mug. Yeah, it was only $2. It was only $2 at the family dollar. Mm. In fact, I mean, I'm not kidding you. I can tell you the story of my life just by playing Not Too Shabbies. I'll show you the family dollar. It's just a few blocks that way. Family dollar, Not Too Shabby. Let's see. Here we go. It's the family dollar store. Not Too Shabby. 
There you go. That's the family dollar. That's where I bought this elephant mug. How about that, ladies and gentlemen? <laughs> oh, you guys. Uh, I'm trying to find more not too shabbies. Family. Wait a minute. Whoa, whoa. Some of these. Uh, all right. I accidentally hit a button, but hey, I did a not too shabby earlier today in my car. It's a Subaru steering wheel. Not too shabby. <laughs> That's pretty basic. Z, I've got like 20, 25 mugs. I'm actually going to be working on putting little hooks. See up there? See that like bar or, you know, going across? And I got I to gotta fix that hole. I'm going to put little like hooks so that all the mugs hang across. That's going to be a little project one of these days. So and there are my, there are my uh, ceramic fish up there. My fish, see them? So, hey, exploring. Hey, buddy. Hey, we're talking about Colorado. You just missed. I played like, I don't know, 10 Colorado themed not too shabbies. And I'm sipping coffee from an elephant mug. Z, yes, I will make a video. I promise. I will. Dwight's going to help me. Dwight's going to help me. Yeah, yeah. So, all right. So, so there you go. By the way, somebody mentioned it. The uh, the Looking Shark tote bag. This is the Looking Shark tote bag. I trust everybody. Uh, most of you have seen this. Not too shabby. Here it is, and we'll hear. <laughs> it's a Looking Shark tote bag. Not too shabby! <laughs> Rarjan, what are you doing, buddy? Rarjan, 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 how are you doing? Yeah, yeah, Z, that was a pretty loud not too shabby. Let's play it again. It's a looking sharp tote bag. Not the only one that I think is is louder is the toy snake. All right, let's just let's pull that one up. Toy snake. Here. It's a toy snake. Not too shabby. I think that's louder. That's it. But this that the looking sharp is second second loudest. <laughs> I should sell this on eBay. Should I autograph it and just put not too shabby Steve Garufi smiley face? Should sell this on eBay. Should I do that? Look, it's it's a tote bag. It's got these cactuses on the side. See? Looking sharp. <laughs> yeah, Z, you're going to buy it? <laughs> All right, I might do an eBay auction. <laughs> Rarjan, do I do not too shabbies because of how funny I find them? Some of my not too shabbies are not that funny, though. I mean, I did one today of a Subaru. Uh, here, wait, where is it here? A, my Subaru steering wheel. And it's not, it's really not funny here. It's a Subaru steering wheel. Not too shabby. You know, it's all right. It's okay. I'm not laughing over that one. It's pretty basic. So, ha, huh. hey, here's the snow. This was last weekend. It is snowing. Not too shabby. Look at that. Look at that snow. Isn't that crazy? Oh, you guys. Ah, uh, it's a great gag, a great gag. That's a compliment, right? <laughs> oh, you guys, what are we going to do? Hey, here's a not too shabby gun. Not too shabby gun. Here. 
it's my not too shabby shooting gun. Oh yeah, there you go. Yeah, thank you, Rajan. Hey, Rajan, see, I'm pronouncing your name just right. Am I the only American that can pronounce your name correctly? Rajan, 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 Rajan. So there you go. Oh yeah. <laughs> Oh, you guys. Exploring, driving from Pueblo to Salida current. Oh, no kidding. Oh, exploring. Okay. You're, you're, you're in Pueblo. You're in Pueblo that way, and you're headed over to Salida. That's cool. And you're in Texas Creek stretching. Cool, man. As you know, I think there's a sign there that says West Cliff. Go left. Or, you know, south. If you're in your direction, it would be left. Hey, exploring, there's a mountain. All right, now, if you're in Texas Creek, there's the mountain to the northeast that I've already hiked up. It's just, it's that first little small mountain. And it is kind of imposing. It's got some prominence. To the southeast is kind of like this pointed peak. It's a little bit cone-shaped or circular at the top. I'm going to be hiking that in the next week or two. I just want to wait for it to be like a little warmer and just on a day where it's sunny. So the Southeast, Southeast of like where that junction is in Texas Creek. All right. It's that big little peak and it's got, it's like sort of, I don't want to say it has a cone. It just has a little distinct circular top a little bit. So send me your good, do you see the mountain? Do you see the mountain I'm talking about? You see the one on the northeast? I hiked that one. Oh, and then actually across the across the highway on the like south side of the highway, you can see the railroad grade, the old railroad grade that used to go from there was a railroad that went from Texas Creek to Westcliff. And you can still see the railroad grade. And they had to do a cut. They they cut the rock up. Here, let me just. Here, let me just, oh, wait, wait, I'll even pull up, I might have a picture. Yeah, exploring that mountain on the southeast part, that's that's going to be mine. I'm trying to find, oh, I got so many pictures on my phone here. I got too many pictures on my phone. I actually have like 2,000 pictures. Anyway, yeah, you're looking at the railroad grade. Do you see the peak that's like southeast, you know, like if you go behind, you know, if you take the bridge over the river, okay, so you're going behind the restaurant, take the bridge, and then kind of to the right is that one prominent peak, that first one. I'm hiking up that. I'm finding a way to get up there. I'm just waiting for the right day. So wish me the best. All right. So let's get back. I'm going to keep the theme on Texas Creek. Colorado, but I'm also going to play. Let's see if I got any not too shabbies around Texas Creek here. Let's see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Arkansas River at Texas Creek. I'm on the banks of the Arkansas River at Texas Creek. Not too shabby. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, soccer. What are you looking up? Wait, here's one Stink Creek Road. This is in Texas. It's Stink Creek Road. Not too shabby. I was biking across America and I was headed towards Abilene when I took that picture. Yeah. Yeah, soccer, you're looking up my town, the Smoky Jack Observatory. People come here to my town to look at the stars. We're kind of like this dark sky. We don't have a lot of light pollution. 
we don't have a large population, so we don't have a lot of light. You know, man-made light, so you can really see the sky well. Yeah, yeah. Did the creek stink? No, I don't. Yeah, I was just the exit. So, mountain scenery in Texas Creek, right there. Here we go. Let's play this. It's a mountain view in Texas Creek. Not too shabby. That's the road that heads up to Westcliff. So, soccer, just show up, man. Soccer, when you come to Colorado, just make sure you like you've got your camera, like your hiking shoes, you know, and just go drive, go find mountain, just go drive, enjoy the mountains, you know. Go, I mean, Westcliff, you can just sit and just look at the mountains. And I don't know. <laughs> watch my videos. You got to watch all my Colorado videos. You know? Yeah, but yeah, soccer. Rajan, really, you got to come to Colorado. To all my British, European, or just any anywhere outside of America, come to Colorado. We really are kind of like, we're the best state. We're, we're one of the best states. Y'all have a great time. Just come in the kind of the summertime. Just come in the summer. You know? <laughs> well, yeah, and the gold panning. Yeah, yeah, exploring. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. The Rocky Mountains. I've You've been to huge cities in America. You found it very touristy. Rajan, what, what cities have you been to in America? I'm just kind of curious. You know? Yeah, you got to come. I mean, here, there's like... I'm going to... All right, I'm going to pull up a video. There's a really neat three-minute video about how Westcliff, Colorado is like... People come here for the dark skies. And... We actually passed ordinances or something where we agreed to like dim our lights and use covered lights to really maximize the the like the sky. Here we took West Cliff Dark Skies. I'm gonna post a video in the comment section. Let's see here. Is this it? Yeah, here it is, here it is. All right, I can't play the video. Everyone here, watch this, watch this, colon. I just put a link, watch that three minute video as you're like, if you're watching me and it's a three minute video about my town of Westcliff and about how people come here to look at the dark sky. It's kind of neat, so. Yeah, yeah, we're just this little town, bunch of ranchers and rednecks and, you know, ordinary ordinary country folk. That's what we are. We're just a very laid-back mountain town. <laughs> Rajan, you've been to Washington, Chicago, and New York? Rajan, I grew up in New Jersey. I grew up in New Jersey. How about that? I grew up in New Jersey, but I kind of got out as quick as I could. So, you know. <laughs> Wait. All right. I just got to invite some of my friends. All right. I worry. Some of my friends. Here. Kelly, comma, I am live streaming right now, and we are talking about Colorado. Com Exclamation point. Join us, smiley face. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Dave Spinelli. Wait. I'll just. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Check out that video. Like, click it and then bookmark it. It's only a three minute video, but it's like for our town. You know, like that great big story. It seems like a big professional, you know, 
media company with these videos. And here they are coming to Westcliff and talking about the dark skies. And it was really well done. And it kind of promotes our town. And, you know, it kind of shows the folksy, you know, this is just a little folksy bunch of friendly people are very friendly here. And, you know, ranchers and just, just, just people who love the mountains. People are definitely friendlier. They're just happier. Colorado is a happier kind of town. You know, Colorado compared to like some eastern state, we are just a happier. We're happier. We live here, you know. Yeah, soccer. Yeah, 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 yeah. My friend in Ireland, she, wait, Sharon, I am live streaming right now. Join us, exclamation point, smiley face. I think it's almost midnight in Ireland. So my friend Sharon, you know, I, I would be so, so amazing if she could come by. But um, anyway, ha, ha, ha. Yeah, soccer, come to Colorado. Come to Colorado. Westcliff, come to Westcliff. Westcliff, Colorado, baby. <laughs> I don't know why, you know. <laughs> this is where I'm at right now, all right? I, I have this thing. I spent four months in Arizona from early November to early March. And I had, I had such a good time there. And now it's like I've got to let go of Arizona for a while. And I got to be into Colorado. But it's just a little hard because it's still not that warm. And I really couldn't go for a good bike ride today. And it's a little depressing. But what are you going to do, man? What are you going to do? So... <laughs> I'm going to text more of my friends. By the way, what to everybody, I asked the question, whether it's live right now or even afterwards, what is your favorite not too shabby? What is your favorite not too shabby? Go with your gut. What's your favorite one? And I'll play it right now, and I'll tell you the backstory behind it if you want. You know, if there is a backstory. So, oh, I got to invite Southpaw. Josh, join us. We are live streaming, exclamation point. Yeah, soccer, you got to come. Just come out to Colorado. You don't have to come to my town, but you should. I really do think you should. So, Rarjan, yeah. Oh, you're going to go to bed? It's only like 5 o'clock in the afternoon here. Really, you're going to go? All right. Take care, my friend. Thanks for coming by. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. Let me just play the one British, my one British, not too ha not too shabby. Here. Where is it here? British, not too shabby. Here it is. It's a British police hat. Not too shabby. That's as British as you can get right there. Yeah, that's as British as you can get. Take care, Rajan. Yeah. Very nice. Yeah, it's a beautiful, not too shabby. It's beautiful, isn't it? <laughs> oh, hey, soccer. I did a not too shabby once. I was uh, watching soccer, and soccer makes me sleepy. So I did a not too shabby about how it was helping me sleep here. Watching a soccer game to help me take a nap. Not too shabby. <laughs> soccer, 20 hours, 20 hours from Indianapolis to Denver. Come on, man. Just, just come on, come on out. So <laughs> that is a long drive, but it can be done, obviously, in under 24 hours. So, yeah, seriously, soccer sometimes makes me sleepy, you know, where they're just standing around and, you know, <laughs> kicking a ball around. 
<laughs> oh, you guys, man. That's my only soccer not too shabby. I'm looking for other not too shabbies, but at least for soccer, that's the one I got. So, you know. <laughs> not too Oh, you guys. Hey, Liam. Hey, Liam. How are you? Much love from... You're in Australia. Get the heck out of here. I'm in Colorado, USA. We got a British guy. Rajan, it's midnight. It's midnight in the United Kingdom. It's 5 p.m. here in the mountain time zone. Colorado, USA. And then Liam, I'm guessing it's more, it, it's what, morning? It's probably about 10 o'clock in the morning in Australia. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Make another one? Soccer, I mean, uh, soccer, I could make another. Well, I am due to, like, the next time I, I'm, and I do like taking naps. Next time I'm going to take a nap, I'll see if there's a soccer game on. And just the lull of like how slow and like, you know, how sleepy it makes me. I'll, maybe I'll do another not too shabby of it. <laughs> yeah, it's 702 in Indianapolis. Liam, what's your favorite not too shabby? What's your favorite not too shabby? Here's a bicycle lane in El Paso. Riding on a bicycle lane in El Paso. Not too shabby. Ah, <laughs> oh, I got so many. How about a yellow bouncy ball? Not too shabby. It just came up here. Let's see here. It's a yellow bouncy ball. Not too shabby. <laughs> oh, you guys. I'm running out of things to talk about in my live stream. I keep inviting my friends. Oh, Aikila. We are live streaming right now! Exclamation point. Oh, Liam, the jalapeno cheddar bagel. Not too shabby. Yeah, here, let me pull that one up. Bagel, not too shabby. This was a very early. So this one I made, this was like November, December 2013. I was at the very beginning of my not too shabby video career. And I made this. I bought a naked bagel, which is like uncut, nothing in it or, you know, just plain with whatever it is. And where did I just go here? Wait, let me pull it up again. And I was outside the supermarket, the Safeway in Salida, Colorado. And I made a not too shabby of it. Here it is. A jalapeno cheddar bagel. Not too shabby. <laughs> hey, wait, I'm wearing the same shirt. I'm wearing the same shirt. Here, look. A jalapeno cheddar bagel. Look at that. Not too shabby. I'm wearing the same shirt. This shirt. This shirt's like 10 years old. It's a little Nike, whatever it is, a long sleeve thingy. Isn't that something? Isn't that, isn't that a coincidence? So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, my gosh. I also have another bagel not too shabby. Let's see here. Sack of blueberry bagels. It's a sack of blueberry bagels. Not too shabby. <laughs> here you go. <laughs> I about three kids in an RV here. It's a bunch of kids in an RV. Not too shabby. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you guys. 
I don't know, man. I'm trying to find more not too shabbies. Hey, soccer. Here's a Mexican ceramic pumpkin. It's a Mexican ceramic pumpkin. Not too shabby. Did you say you've got a Mexican background? There's the pumpkin, Mexican pumpkin. Isn't that something? <laughs> I got more Mexican things. I got Mexican things all over my house. Hey, hey, soccer. Here's a Mexican music store. It's a Mexican music store. Not too shabby. <laughs> yeah, you're from Mexico. You're Mexican? I'll give you Mexican. Here. Here's a... Here's a panaderia. Here. It's the Rocket Panderia Mexican Bakery. Not too shabby. I pronounced it wrong. It's a panaderia. So, yeah, I'll give you Mexican. Here. Here's Habanero Mexican Grill. It's the Habanero Mexican Grill. Not too shabby. Oh, yeah. There you go. <laughs> I got so many Mexican food. Humberto. Oh, I love this. Humberto's Mexican restaurant. This is a really good place. It's in Gila Bend, Arizona. It's Humberto's Mexican restaurant. Not too shabby. <laughs> hey, George. <laughs> Liam, you've been watching the Not Too Shabby since 2014? What year? It's 2021 now. It's seven years. You've been watching my Not Too Shabbies for seven years. Isn't that crazy? Oh, my gosh. A hike. Here, a hike with a view of Mexico. Not Too Shabby. Here. All right. A hike with a nice view of Mexico out there. Not too shabby. I was on a mountain in uh, New Mexico, like close to El Paso in America. And you can see the neighborhood. That's I was looking into Mexico. A hike with a nice view of Mexico out there. Not too shabby. There you go. Oh, yeah. Ha, 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 ha. George, what are you doing? I'm just playing not too shabbies. Here's a video of four-pound taco in New Jersey. That looks so good, a four-pound taco in New Jersey. Oh, my gosh, that's making me hungry. Oh, my gosh. Hey, I got more Mexican. Driving with Mexican music. Here, driving with it. Driving with Mexican music playing. See, I got the Mexican music too. Ha 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 ha. Yeah, yeah, I was up on that hill. Um, the hill, there was a hill I hiked up. Uh, I actually got, I should have pictures of it. But I, at the University of Texas El Paso, you're up on this hill and it overlooks, you definitely can look down into Mexico across the Rio Grande. So yeah, it is really pretty there. So I'm trying to find a picture. I don't know if I've got a picture. It'd be nice if I... Oh, here. Well, this is... Here it is. It's not too... I was up on this mountain, this little hill. All right. And then... So I'm on this mountain. There's the highway. There's actually two highways. And then you can see that little berm, that little wall. And then most of the picture is in Mexico. That's Ciudad Juarez. That's Juarez right there. Right there. Very nice. So there you go. <laughs> Ciudad Juarez. So 
Yeah, George, I didn't celebrate. I was, you know, it wasn't something, I don't know. I wasn't celebrating, but yeah, I mean, you know, justice was served. It was more about accountability um, that that officer who, I mean, murdered that uh, George Floyd. Yeah. So it was, I obviously, you know, I saw the video I was horrified over that video last year. So I don't know how much I want to say about it right now, but I do support like long-term justice and reform so that something like that never happens again. So, you know, I am happy that there was justice, but I'm also, my heart aches for that officer. I saw, like I saw his reaction when they were reading guilty, 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 three counts. And he looked kind of confused. He looked like uh, there was a part of me that felt compassion. Like I want him to know grace and forgiveness, you know, but anyway, yeah, I mean, uh, but yeah, of course it was the right decision and justice was served and uh, we'll just leave it at that. So yeah. All right, let's get back. <laughs> let's play more. <laughs> I want to look up more. I'm just going to look up straight up Mexican food, not too shabby. If we're going to talk about Mexican anything, we're going to talk about Mexican food. All right. And I got all these like Mexican food, like Mexican restaurants here. Like, do I got any enchiladas? Hey, here's the consulate, the consulate general of Mexico, the consulate general, general of Mexico. It's the general consulate of Mexico. Not too shabby. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Laura, you ate nine tacos after a 34-mile bike ride? Wow. Hey, Jack. Hey, Jack. Hey, how about a pumpkin empanada? I eat a pump. That's a Mexican food. It's a pumpkin empanada. Not too shabby. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Jack, how are you? What's your favorite not too shabby? I'm looking for more food. Ooh, a beef taco. A beef taco. Not too shabby. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah. I've always, Liam, you've always wanted to go visit the Southwest, Southwestern USA, Colorado, New Mexico. Yeah, Liam, that's my videos. My videos are mostly Colorado, New Mexico, Arizona. You need to come visit. Come on out. Come on out. The weather's nice too, you know? <laughs> a not too shabby for your dead dog. I don't know how I could do that. I'm not sure about that, but I'm sorry about the loss of your dog. I'm very sorry. Hey, Kelly. Hey, hey, the Kilbys are here. Hey, I'm in my kitchen. I got my taco sign. All right. To the Kilby family. I also got my burger sign right there. Burgers. All right, tacos and burgers. I do it right. I do it right in my home. And the theme today is I got this um, elephant mug. I still got some coffee in here. This mug was only $2 at the Family Dollar in town. Yeah, yeah. Hey, Kelly. Is Rich there? Is your boy there? Huh. Ha, ha. Pozole Mexican food is good. Yeah, we've been talking about Mexican food. Oh, here's a good one. Here's a good recent Mexican food one. Shredded beef taco. I just remember how crunchy. It was so tasty and crunchy. It's a shredded beef taco. Not too shabby. 
Oh my gosh, I'm just getting so hungry. Oh my gosh. Hey Christian. Hey buddy. Oh Christian. Christian, are you jealous? Because I've got I've got your sister. I've got your your sister's in a not too shabby, but you're not. Are you jealous? You got a little sibling rivalry? Look, Christian, your sister's in a not too shabby. Ha ha ha. A teenager with a pink phone. Here we go. It's a teenage girl talking on a pink phone. Not too shabby. <laughs> oh, you guys. You guys. Let me just find more. I got more Mexican food. I know I have more. Let me just type in enchilada. Enchilada, not too shabby. I think I've got enchilada. Here, chicken enchiladas. Chicken enchiladas, not too shabby. Oh, my gosh. I'm getting so hungry. Oh, my God. It looks so good. Here. <laughs> it's chicken enchiladas. Not too shabby. Oh, my gosh. So good. Here's a random one. Coffee with the Methodists. There's a Methodist church. Uh, over there, a few blocks. The coffee with the Methodists. And we were having a little coffee social. And I did a not too shabby. Here. Having coffee with my Methodist friends. <laughs> not too shabby! Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, you guys. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Have I ever fallen off my bike while filming? Um, I have not. I've I've rarely fallen off my bike. I've, I have fallen off. I can think of one time. That was like 2005 or 2004 in Colorado Springs. I, fell, I can't believe I fell off too. Oh, no, no. But I did tumble off my bike a few times when my shoes lock in. I, I, I forgot to unlock my shoes from the clips. I have fallen a few times, but not, not while filming. No, I haven't. So that's a nice one, though. I have dropped my phone while filming. So, yeah, the Methodist coffee one. Terry. Terry is uh, the, the guy with the white beard. He's my neighbor. And then the woman to the right uh, in black she passed. That's Pastor Vet's mom. So she passed like a year ago. She's a sweet woman too. So we had fun. Anyway, just fun memories, man. Yeah, yeah. Kelly, I fell over a tent and knocked you over? What are you talking about? Like what, when we were camping? I fell over a tent? I knocked you over? Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. <laughs> All right, everybody, we have almost like I Kelly, you're like a sidekick in a way. But I got it, everyone. I got to show my connection might get kind of funny here. Okay. And if that's the case, I'm really sorry if we get disconnected. But let me see. Everyone, Kansas Kelly. <laughs> Kelly in the chat section is that girl right there. This was like 15, 18 years ago. We got in a fight in a car. We were on a long road trip and we just lost our tempers and we got into a fight. <laughs> oh my gosh. Kelly, that was a bad fight. <laughs> so there you go. The Kelly in the chat section. So <laughs> I called it crazy fight in a car and it's been watched 2,700 times. And I think, uh, I think YouTube has flagged it because they, they're really getting strict about like things being clean and they don't even want videos of people fighting. So, or whatever, you know, so 
<laughs> Soccer, what did you think of the fight? <laughs> oh my gosh. Good times, man. Good times. Wait, let me see. I think the uh wait. Kelly, the dogs. Your dogs are in a not too shabby. <laughs> Your dogs here. I don't. I hopefully you still have your three dogs. And here's the not too shabby. Here, it's the three dogs in the Kilby household. Not too shabby. <laughs> what do you think, <laughs> everyone? I'm talking to Kelly directly here because Kelly's a longtime friend, and that's just the way it is. Um, also, I remember I did a not too shabby. Let's see, where is it here? A truck. Wait, oh, wait, wait, I know where it is. Handy, not too shabby. Kelly, what's the name of uh, Rich's business? Dogs. Wait, it was dogs, something dogs. Here, big dogs, handyman, not too shabby. Big dog's handyman, not too shabby. It's a big dog's handyman truck. Not too shabby. <laughs> big dogs. Hell yeah, big dog's not too shabby. It's a big dog's handyman truck. Not too shabby. <laughs> Good times, man. Good times. <laughs> Wait, I think I got, is there any more with Kelly? Kelly, not too shabby. <laughs> Let me see. Kelly, not too, sin. What the heck is this? No. Uh, there's no other. Oh, the price chopper. That's right. There's everyone. There's a, a supermarket by where Kelly lives. Out, it's in Kansas City. It's it's called a price chopper. And here's the not too shabby. I really like this supermarket too. It's a great supermarket. So I really meant it when I said it's not too shabby. Here. It's a price chopper supermarket. Not too shabby. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. So Oh, Kelly, this is at your dad's house. This is at your dad's house. The Razorback breakfast here. It's a Razorback's blanket. Not too shabby. Ha, 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 ha. Oh, Kelly, I got more. Kelly, do you remember this one? Were you even there? I don't even think you were there. Here, Kelly. Look at this, right here. It's breakfast in Arkansas. Not too shabby. <laughs> <laughs> breakfast in Arkansas. That's right. So there you go. I, I got to stop like doing, uh, like playing videos of food because I'm getting hungry here. And actually, it is 525 here. And um, I might go out to eat or something. I might go out to eat. Yeah. Guys, I think I'm going to wrap this up pretty soon because <laughs> I'm getting hungry. This is becoming like, you know, I all I had was uh, coffee from my elephant mug. Mm. It's actually cold now. <laughs> I should do a not too shabby at this mug. Ha ha ha. Soccer, take care of yourself. It's kind of weird the way it's like an hourglass. You can't even get to all the. Okay. I don't know if I'm going to do a not too shabby of my elephant mug. Hey, I already did it. Here, I'll show you. I've got my. Uh, I've got my metal roadrunner here. He rocks with the wind. The wind is so strong that the wind knocks over the roadrunner. 
But this is my rug. I already did it not too shabby of this. And look, underneath neath its feathers, it says made in Mexico. See, it says Mexico right there. Isn't this amazing? A metal roadrunner. Ha, 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 Kelly. <laughs> oh, how old is Christian now? How old's Christian? How old is he? Let me see. I don't have any not too shabbies with Christian. That kind of bothers me a little bit. You know? Like, uh, oh, hey, a long time ago, speaking of teenagers, this is uh, Matthew in Buena Vista, my friends in Buena Vista. I did a teen boys cluttered bathroom. Uh, clean a bedroom. <laughs> not here. It's a cluttered bedroom of a teenage boy. Not too shabby. <laughs> 16 years old? Oh, my gosh. Let me just see if I've got anything 16, not too shabby. No. How about Orlando Airport Gate 16? Not too shabby. Here. <laughs> it's Gate 16 at the airport. <laughs> not too shabby. I was very low key because I was in a public place, you know. Oh, here's one. My WTF mug. Let me just play this. I'm just on a roll here. My WTF mug, not too shabby. The WTF stands for welcome to Fruta. Welcome to Fruta. Here. It's my WTF mug. Not too shabby. Ha 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 ha! Let's play that one more time. It's my WTF mug. Not too shabby. Ha 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 By the way, I want to say something. There are no commercials on my live stream. None. No video ads. None of those annoying, you know eight second video ads that you have to watch and then you can click skip ad. None of that on my channel anymore. I don't know if I can do anything about the display ad, that little rectangular thing that comes up. I don't think I can do anything about it. I already looked into it, but no video ads at all, whether it's live or whether you're watching it later on. It's my new system. All right. So you're welcome to super chat me, but actually don't, you don't have to super chat me. I'm doing okay. But you know what I mean? Like, if that's the only way I'll do it is if it's a super chat or, you know, I don't know. You know, maybe, or I might actually sell this on eBay. This looking sharp tote bag. Here, <laughs> Here it is, people. I might sell this on eBay. I might have to do it. Let me, uh, wait, hold on. I'm trying to do three things at once. Where's the tote bag? Here, here's the tote bag, not too shabby. It's a looking sharp tote bag. Not too shabby! <laughs> All right, maybe I'll do a not too shabby of this elephant. It is a nice looking ele it's a nice looking mug. You know? Let me just see. How is this? Not too shabby. Should I do the, hey, Cle hey, hey, uh, Scanlon, hey, you're, you're in Ireland, get out of here, Scanlon, hey, um, I can't pronounce your first name because the Irish have crazy Gaelic pronunciations that defy my language, but I'm just calling you Scanlon, Scanlon, we celebrated St. Patrick's Day, did you see my live stream on St. Patrick's Day? We celebrated all things Irish. We were totally going crazy, like, with Irish things. Yeah, yeah. And we love the Irish. We love all people. We love all people on my, like, you know, in my YouTube community. But we made a big deal about the Irish and green things and leprechauns and shamrocks. You know, looking for the pot of gold at the end of the rainbow outside of Dublin. Wait, hold on, hold on. 
Let's see here. Do I still have? I've got here. This is all I have left from the St. Patrick's Day celebration. This green garland. This green garland with the the uh, shamrocks right there. See the shamrocks? See? And then also here, it's like a little happy St. Patrick's Day hat. You put it on. <laughs> happy St. Patrick's Day. Gotta love the Irish. Love green things. You know, long live the Irish. So I don't even know what St. Patrick's, uh, what Patrick did. Some dude named Patrick. He did something good to become a, a you know, to obtain sainthood. So, but uh, yeah, yeah. It's a yellow Subaru Crosstrack. <laughs> Wait. Not too shabby. It's weird how it, it played a not too shabby. I didn't even touch my phone and it just played it. So, all right, I'm going to do a not too shabby of, I'm going to do a not too shabby of my elephant mug. All right, let's just do it. Let's just do it. Uh, I'm going to put, let me put it up here. Like this. Got my Roadrunner. Where's my, oh, here we go. All right, here we go. It's an elephant mug. It's an elephant mug. Not too shabby. I don't know how that, let me just see how that came out. It's an elephant mug. Not too shabby. Now I'm doing it over again. I'm doing it over again. <laughs> I deleted it. I'm doing it over again. I'm going to go. Not, all right. I know what I'm going to do. It's a. Okay. It's an elephant coffee mug. Not too shabby. That, that, that. I like that one. It's a little more. Not too shabby. It's an elephant coffee mug. I don't know. I'm doing it over again. I'm doing it over again. You're seeing me. This is how I make them sometimes. It's an elephant coffee mug. Not too shabby. All right, I think that one. That one, That's going to be the best one. Ha, 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 ha. Here. I don't know. Which one? Which one should I go with? This one? It's an elephant coffee mug. Not too shabby. Nah, this look too fake. It's an elephant coffee mug. Not too shabby. We're going with the last one. We're going with the last one. Anyway, I made, I made it not too shabby. So I'll upload it when I'm done with the live stream. I made a, here, I made a, I have made 2,224 not too shabbies. And with this one, this one will be 2,225. So yeah, Liam, I made a not too shabby. Take care, Kelly. Good luck with your tuxedo shopping. So I hope, hope that goes out well. hope that goes well. It's an elephant coffee mug. Not too shabby. I don't know. Let me watch that one more time. It's an elephant I gotta... coffee mug. Not too shabby. Yeah, that's it. That's it. This is the one. I'm going with the, the the coffee mug. The coffee mug, not too shabby. All right, people. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. Uh I'm really I'm getting hungry. I'm getting hungry. 
I might get, it's my day off. So I can kind of, you know, like I can eat out or something, but I'm not eating in restaurants yet. Not until I'm fully vaccinated. I get my second shot on Friday and then I'm just waiting two weeks after my shot. By May, May 7th is the date where I'll still wear a mask. I'm still going to follow COVID protocols and expectations, but I'm not going to be as bent out of shape. I'm really excited about it. So, all right, but I'm going, I'm going to go out. To, I'm going somewhere in town to eat. So bye everyone. I'm just talking all my love and please welcome my new elephant mug, my coffee mug, not too shabby. Here's, here it is one more time. Here's the not too shabby. <laughs> All my love from Westcliff, Colorado. Everyone come visit Colorado. Liam, Scanlon, soccer, if you're still around, come visit Colorado. Come on out. The mountains are pretty. All right. If you live in Indiana or Kansas or Missouri, why not come to Colorado? We just have a lot more scenery. Come on, man. Come visit. All right. So take care. I guess that's all I got. All my love and stay tuned because I might sell this on eBay. We'll see. The Looking sharp tote bag. All right. All right. Signing off. Take care. Bye-bye. So long. There's my taco sign. I love that sign so much. <laughs> Bye.